Giovanna, how do you feel about flying? Like on a plane? Yeah. It's fine. I love those tiny bags of snack. Mmm, I really miss those honey roasted peanuts on planes. Mm, not a pretzel guy. But I digress. I guess I should say, how do you feel about flying a plane? Me? Flying a plane? Yes. I feel like me flying a plane would be a very bad idea and a disaster. I've been known to have my head in the clouds, but not because I'm flying a plane. You know what? Same. We should leave the flying to professionals. But I'm going to tell you about another teenager who is actually qualified and working on becoming the youngest woman to fly solo around the world. Did you say teenager? I sure did. Let me tell you more. 19-year-old Zara Rutherford is the daughter of two pilots, so the question of how does a 19-year-old decide she's going to fly around the world solo makes a bit more sense. Her decision to attempt the solo flight was made to inspire other young women to go into the field of aviation, science, technology, mathematics, and engineering. On her journey, she landed in Jakarta, Indonesia to speak to a group about how her solo journey was going. Let's take a look at some of the challenges she faced so far during the course of her 32,000 mile journey around the globe. One of the biggest challenges flying solo is when you have nobody that you can uh, kind of discuss ideas with. If something is going wrong and you're not sure, your mind can play tricks on you, right? You, you are sometimes as a pilot, you are a human at the end of the day, you are biased. So it's quite good to be able, being able to discuss with someone what the best decision is. And so that's one thing is that I have to make a decision by myself and make sure that as rational as I can, I can as they can be. Um, when the weather's bad, is it safer to keep going and see what that's like, or is it safer to fly back? From Rutherford began her journey in August 2021 and plans to complete the solo trek across five continents and 52 countries by mid-January 2022. She is attempting to break the current record for the youngest female pilot to complete a solo flight around the world. Shasta Ways, the current record holder, was 30 years old when she completed her journey in 2017. Zara Rutherford is truly an inspiration, not just to young women, but to everyone who sets out with a goal and then makes an effort to complete it. Let's hear one more time from Zara about how you don't have to fly around the globe to feel accomplished. Every time I get in the plane, even if it is doing circuits, that's its own adventure. That's its own thing that I'm accomplishing, and that I'm, I'm doing, that's me doing that. And so that's why I, I just, every time I fly, I'm accomplishing a little something that I just, I'm really happy that I can do. Wow, 19 years old and her goal was to fly around the world solo? Seriously, and she's doing it. We could definitely take a page out of Zara's book about setting goals and sticking to them. But let's leave flying planes to the professionals. And if you, Next Gen viewers, find yourself in the cockpit of a plane, do not attempt to fly it around the world. Great advice, Trenton.